Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. Today we take a listen to all the rectifier models and pretty much all these modelers that I've collected over a period of time. Let's go ahead and get into it. <laughs> Okay, so for anyone who's been here on this channel for a while knows I've been wanting to do a video like this for quite a while. I wasn't totally sure how I was going to do it. I tend to like to be very in the weeds and in the details with these things. But when you're comparing this many devices, that's a very difficult thing to do. I don't really think there is a great way to do it. So I decided to do it this way instead of just waiting on it forever and never getting the video done. Um, I ended up taking inspiration from Ola England and his video that he did, All Amps Sound the Same, if you hadn't guessed. <laughs> but yeah. Um, so basically what we did was I dialed in a tone on my uh, dual rectifier back here. It's a, a Roadster combo. Um, I have a Ibanez Tube Screamer, Tube Screamer Mini running into it. And then I built a very similar patch on each of these uh, devices. Yeah, just using a uh, Tube Screamer model into the dual rectifier model that each of these one have when possible using the vintage mode. Some of them have a vintage mode, some of them do not specify whether it's the vintage or the modern mode or whatever. The uh, actual amp is in is vintage mode. Uh, but yeah, I tried to use pretty much the exact set same settings um, in the modeler as are on the real amp. Most, I, I was very happy with how this turned out. For most of the modelers, that worked out very well. For other ones, um, either the gain was just way higher on the modeler or it just sounded off. And in those cases, I did adjust a little bit, but for the most part, it wasn't the... Uh, I didn't mess with the EQ. The EQ is pretty much the same across all these units. But in those cases, I tended to either mess with the overdrive model just a little bit or just turn the game down or up, at whatever the case may have been. I didn't really want to spend too much time trying to exactly match it to the sound of the rectifier. Maybe that's something y'all want me to do for the next video, if y'all want me to do a video like this again. So I can, as of right now, I can do a similar video with the Soldano SLO model because um, I have the Synergy uh, Soldano SLO. I can do that. And I'm thinking I can do a Friedman style uh, video using my uh, Cherry Tone Leviathan. It gets pretty close to the uh, Friedman HBE sound, which most of these modelers have a Friedman HBE model. Um, but yeah. Oh, so all the modelers are running through the uh, my KSR PA50, which has 606 power tubes in it. All that information will be in the description. Let's go ahead and get to the comparison. I hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> 